So yeah, 6S on the Emacs Magnum stack, no modifications. I just figured, based on my experience flying 5S on the Magnum, I've killed one and had one successful flight. The good flight I had was on the RS 2306 2400. And the bad flight I had was on 2206, like 2800. But I figured maybe it's just the amp draw. And it's looking like it is just the amp draw. Let's try this again. Yeah, I figured if you can keep the amp draw down, um, the ESC will survive just fine on regardless of the voltage. Maybe not regardless, you know, up to 6L. So yeah, I've got maybe 20 packs to this quad. Crashed it a bunch during a race on Sunday. No issues. 1900 KV, which is probably kind of high. No issues. Um, so pretty happy that I don't have to buy all new stacks to race success this year. Yeah, even with his GoPro on there, it just flies awesome. Um, these motors are 1700 kV. You know, the 1900 kV quad works well. I just had to figure out some ESC settings because I was having desyncs uh, on hard 180s. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and say that if you want to, you can run 6S on a Magnum with, you know, 1900 kV motors or below. You know, just make sure you have a low ESR 1000 cap or two. Um, you might have to tune some ESC settings. I had to change my DMAG to high on the 1900 kV quad, 1700 kV quad. It's using all the same settings as 4S. Um, and it just works. I mean, I crashed the hell out of this thing on Sunday. I dented a motor, um, 
broken arm, broke some frame pieces. You might have seen those posts on Facebook. I mean, I beat the hell out of that quad. And you know, that's usually what kills ESCs. And, and you know, the Magnum, you know, for me and Zero, it's always been amazing, always. I mean, I've only killed one and that was on, you know, 5S 2800 KV. Um, but yeah, I'm just, I'm blown away. I'm impressed. You know, these, these electronics that I've had since last summer are going to carry me into 2018 flying success. Thanks for watching guys.